Okay, I want to talk about deliverance from the cannabis. I'm sorry, my eye is a little weird. Ignore that, please. So, cannabis itself can be a depressant. And sometimes what can happen is if you smoke too much, you're smoking because of, it's a way as a coping mechanism. Now, I do believe that, you know, cannabis was in the Bible. We talk about the herbs and the oils and everything like that. So, there's nothing wrong with consuming it as needed but when you overindulge to the point where you're always intoxicated by that and you're not as sober and you're not your mind is not as clear and free that's when it becomes a problem overindulging in anything can be too much even if you drink too much water you can get sick and so just because something is good doesn't mean like if you do it too much it can cause problems okay i'm gonna get my eye out this camera so anyway what I also want to say is that you may have been feeling right now that God has been calling you to walk away from the smoking, to just kind of leave it alone, to let it go, to really just be more sober because God really just wants you to have a pure divine connection to you. And sometimes that can, you know, mess up the connection between you and the divine. And if you've been feeling this for a while, but you know, sometimes you just keep going back to it. Like you tell yourself, I'm done. I'm going to take a break. But then it's, uh, let me just go back and get another one. I'm telling you what happens is the flesh is weak. The flesh is weak. And what will happen is the enemy will send tests into your life. will send stuff into your life to try to tempt you. T will send the temptation into your life. You know, so they, they, they hit you up. Hey, you want to smoke? Hey, I can bring this up to your house. I can, I can drop it off. You need some temptation. Will you resist the temptation or will you give in to the temptation? It's up to you. It's up to you. Are you going to be obedient or are you going to be hard-headed? It's up to you. And you can get delivered from it. You can absolutely get delivered from it by complete sobriety, by telling your, yourself, telling your mind, I don't need this. I do not need this. And when you tell yourself you don't need it, you stop using it. And I'm telling you, if you have it right now, your obedience and you and just humbling yourself and being obedient to the most high God, get rid of it, get rid of it, throw it away or give it to somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Because if you can be humble and give it away or get rid of it or throw it away and tell God, I am fully submitting to you. I am letting go of my addictions. I am releasing that. I want to put my full faith and trust in you. Your blessings are going to start to pour. What if your blessings ain't come yet because you ain't let go of those addictions? Maybe I was there too. I was delivered and you could be delivered too. Let's go. Deliverance. Deliverance, baby.